Alright guys, here's a little special. Um, as you guys know, I was recording these slash streaming these uh, almost two and a half, three years ago. Um, I said I was going to come back after I get far enough in into the into the season, and I never got a chance to do that, and I ended up getting to the playoffs. Uh, my player has been a dynamic player, obviously, but unfortunately, <laughs> we're at the point of no return. This is game six. We're down 3-2 in the series in the second round, and I apologize for the fan blowing, but it's fucking hot over here, so bear with me. With that being said, um, I decided to play the last couple minutes, see what happens if I win it. I'll play one more game. It'll be game seven. If we lose that game, or if we win it, or we lose this game, or whatever, um, then I'm gonna. The season's gonna be over. I might get drafted with a team, and I wanted to show you guys what team I end up picking. Um, and, who, and who knows? Maybe every now and then I'll do, I'll do a, a couple of videos playing this. I'm playing on the PS4 version, obviously, and I'm on the PS4. Um, that's kind of what I was playing for the last. Uh, week I would say <clears throat> since you know I don't want to play Elden Ring too much I kind of got burnt out believe it or not so I don't know we'll, we'll have to see how that goes but anyway let's just jump right in um, like I said um, my play has been taking an insane amount of penalties cause not by choice <laughs> I just kept trying to poke stick poke the puck away from the players and I kept tripping people so Again, it's it's not like it was intentional, but I do have a goal and assist, 14 shots, plus minus one, which is not bad, honestly, uh, all things considering, but we're probably going to end up losing this game, so let's just jump right in it. And a save. He holds that one, and it's a good thing because they were buzzing. That ship was looking really dangerous with all that pressure. Hold on a minute. It's actually... I don't know what it is. The settings are low on this. Can I bump up the audio, maybe, for the commentary at least? Let me see. Let's do. Let's bump some of the. Well, not this actually. I'm gonna decrease the arena music. I don't want to hear that crap. Uh, crowd, get that to bump five. Okay, that's that's pretty good. I'll adjust this when I go back off. As you can see, the team play is garbage. So here it goes. We're about to be the ending of the game right here. Let's see if I can do something. And the, unfortunately, with these type of games, there's really not much I can commentate over, other than the fact that, you know... Alright, let's get Loose going here. The the go. Yeah! Ooh! And they <laughs> nice! <laughs> yes! Very nice. Very nice. You scored. Woo! And I got an assist on that because I gave it to him. So that's two assists, one goal for me. Very good, very good. Alexei Lepanov. We came into the game, guys, thinking these teams were evenly matched. Now we've played some of this contest, and here we are, back at a stalemate. Nice. Let, let's see if I can get a game win again. Another game under our belt, and let's see what happens with the magic. Oh, boy. Clutch time. I don't know. If this goes into a fucking overtime, I think I'm screwed. And they won the faceoff. Because I, I, haven't, I, I haven't actually gone to overtime yet in, in the, in the postseason. There we go. I finally got a successful poke check. Shit. Probably gonna have to go on a bank soon. I haven't done anything. No. Guaranteed the goalie never saw it, but I know he heard it. That's how hard it was. Oh, the good old days of Eddie Olchek. Yeah, okay, I'm going on. Okay, we'll see what happens. Overtime. Actually, the funny thing is, I was actually going to record another game, but we were already that losing. I think we were 3 1, and something was happening, and I couldn't um, 
do something, like it wasn't connecting properly, and I and I thought something was wrong. I accidentally turned off the game, and the and the <laughs> that particular game I was playing. I mean, I, did, I didn't just turn off the console plus the game. I turned off the actual match game I was playing, and I was injured throughout the entire fucking third period. Um, but I came back and I destroyed that next game, so I didn't bother recording it. Now we're in overtime. That's it. One shot, one score, that's it. Let's see if I can pull off a magic trick and get that, ne that next greasy goal. Because I've, I've one goal, I think. Underway in sudden death overtime. Let's see who gets the winner. I have to make sure I do not. Sudden death. Puck free. Kitchener's continuing on through center ice. There we go. Uh, see, this is the problem I have with this game this far. I actually haven't played enough of this game at all when I bought it. it. They claim it's realistic. That's not realistic at all. I'm sorry. It's just bullshit. Especially when they want you to, to play like that. Oh, I thought that was me. I was got Oh, I'm sorry. I thought I was the one who passed the buck there, but it wasn't. Kitchener's looking to head man up the wing. Uh, I'm just playing so bad right now. I don't know He's what's happening. The corner. I was trying. Well, I was trying to wait for the pass, and then he just intercepted it with a nice back check. So it wasn't like. Not a long pass, but effective. He's got it. One timer. Oh, and he robbed him. Why would he? Oh my God, the AI is so bad. Why would he back it right there when I'm right there? Like I don't understand why they do why they did that. Goodness gracious! I, I just don't understand this game at all. The AI is just so weird. It's not even, and it's on pro difficulty, and it's they're so terrible. Trying to go to Murphy. Crosses that line on the outside. Wow! What the hell? I thought my stick broke for a second. Why was it that bad? Usually I would. Do like a rocket of a shot, but not there. Uh, that's that's Under a little three weird. minutes have passed. Both teams with three. That's our score. Oh, I miss. I, I miss. Um, a clean win. <laughs> well, in My camera. He was the still. He was. No he's the best. Name is let that go. What? And finally, the whistle blows, and they can tend to it. Guys, bone jarring hit here. He was hurt immediately. Well, short uh, I think his tooth broke out as well. He saw he had missing tooth. <laughs> I don't know if that was by design or not, <laughs> but that was funny. They won the face off. Chip to Murphy. Fires. Great glove save. Oh, uh, what? Oh. Uh, he caught it with his glove. I thought he shouldered it out or something. That's the problem with poke checks. It doesn't. It's not. It doesn't. It's not really successful like it used to be. They 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 ruined the game. I haven't played NHL 20, NHL 21, or 22, so I have no idea how any of those games play. Uh, because I'm boycotting those games, they no longer have Mike Emmerich and Eddie Olchek. To me, this is typical hockey. When you play hockey, you hear those two. You know you're playing an authentic game. Ray Ferraro. I mean, he's commentating the games now on on ESPN, but. But it's not the same. Hold on, man, guys. I, I want to actually move this. Oh, no, that's not why I want to move at all. God damn it. Media source. There we go. There we go. Sorry about that. Quick work on the face off. Using the point, he's got it. 
That pass in the corner. He knifed it away. Perfectly on his stick in that pass from the left wing. On to Murphy. Has that point pass as well. Piped in the slot. Terrific save. Oh, no. This puck being so close to that, this is all a reactionary save. Pin to the glass. Scrum over. Puck kicked. Going after the overtime win with pressure. Rips one. Oh, and what a spectacular save. Oh, and it's a penalty. No! Did I get a penalty? Oh, no, wait. I didn't hook. That was Gre Greffa. Oh, man. That sucks, monkey. Yep, there he goes. We lost in overtime. I knew it. as soon as they got that penalty, I didn't want to be the one to take the penalty. That's why I didn't do it. Thank you, Mike Emmerich. Alright, so that was the end of the season, as I thought. Which is nice, you know. Well, you're not going to win them all. So. And we tried. We did our best. You can see some of the goals that we did here. When they get to, loser goes no, I passed that over, by the way. On. And there's one that I did later on as well. Don't miss our next one. Right here. Ray <laughs> Bam. So long for now. Well, that's how it's... Well, hopefully I'll play for the real Rangers in the NHL, and not this AHOHL bullshit that I was doing. Completely terrible. Look at this. <laughs> Costly penalties. Actually, I was part of the reason why we lost this game because I took two penalties and I think we both they both scored on both of them. So, well, at least one of them they definitely scored upon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It sucks. Yeah, like now I'm 70 but I used to. Used to be fucking seventy eight. <laughs> Things just dro dropping. Uh, man, that was terrible. I feel just. Uh, I feel so bad. But anyway, this is where some of my stats are currently at right now. Defense is pretty good. Level eight could be better. Physicality needs to be improved dramatically. I think my. Uh, I don't want to say aggressive. Well, maybe aggressiveness, but some of the stuff needs to be improved. I think at least the level. This one's actually pretty good. I want to get balance up to 80 if I, I can figure out, how, figure out how to do that. And, well, well. Puck skills are top notch. And, obviously, this one's actually not too bad. I want to get wrist, wrist shot power to 80. I don't know how I do that, though. Well, one goal, two assists, four hits. Yeah. It's all she wrote. Oh, I have I have nine, I have nine special traits, but I have no idea what to put them in just yet. I want to wait, see maybe something opens up. It's the end of the playoffs. It's always tough to be living in the playoffs, but look at the bright side. At least you have to draft. Look forward. Two, your great play throughout the year has turned you into a top ten pick. Good luck, and I'll see you at the draft. All right, so the skill tree. Let me show you what you guys have right now. <clears throat> As you guys can see, I'm 77 overall. I have nine special points available for the special for the specialties. So I put a whole bunch into this. Obviously, I have some in here. Um, I did put one into pass master. Mm. Summon to skating. I did this for uh, acceleration. Actually, I think this is for balance and endurance, it looks like. This one's for acceleration. This one's for speed. None in physical, none for defense. I think I want to start putting more into. Uh, uh, what is this? Maybe. I don't know. Puck skills, maybe? Or maybe. No. Physicality, maybe? Because I think that's the t that's the stuff that's not getting upgraded enough 
for some apparent reason. I have to start thinking about all the stuff. Like, I don't really care about half of this, but defense, uh, defense, oh, face off, face offs can be pretty good. Like, you can go all the way up to a decent amount. And this is the things I have, because this is the thing I don't know what I want. Do I want to get this? Do I want to get that? Because these are specialties. This isn't really improving in the short term. This is just, like, for example, in, uh, in NHL, Mika Zabanejad is a is a blistering one-time shot. So he'd be getting something like... Oh, did I just... No, I'm trying to find... I think it was down here somewhere. Okay, this is a one-time wonder. This is like slight increased action for one time. So he's more likely to have this. The deflection master, like for let's say Chris Kreider on the Rangers, he would have something like this. Um, stretch passer. This is probably something from um, Artemi Panarin would be having most likely. Um, windmill Deeks, Deeks in general, surprise shot, protected net, breakaway, just a rebound, rubber man, medic. Quick release, that could be something useful. And this shot power. That would be... But again, do I want to waste my time with that? Again? Like, you have to understand, like, where do I... What do I choose? What would be better right now? Or long term? You know, stuff like that I have to really start considering. This is completely worthless for me. Oh, back to getting speed. Eh... I'm not. See, this is the other stuff I don't know, so. <clears throat> so, I don't know what to choose on that for now. Uh, let's go to the draft. Let's see what they have to offer. We'd like to say. Choose training. Alright, so let me see here. 17. So that's. I don't need defensive awareness so much. Balance and agility is not bad. Definitely don't need this. Definitely don't need this. Well, I mean, I could. Uh, I mean... <clears throat> Endurance and durability. Strength. Get one to there. Skip there. Put no one in there. All right. Let's see. Let's do that. Very nice. Very nice. Unfortunately, my <laughs> discipline's gone way down. But I can figure that out later on. I, oh, oh, our profile won't be a bit, won't be taking too many penalties. Choose twenty-four. Okay, so now, like I said, I want to get balanced up. I believe. Uh, so let me get two of these. One of the strength. <clears throat> two into that. Get one for slap shot. Let's get another one to wrist shot training. That's a pretty decent uh, thing. Three laterals, two sprints, you know. Hmm. Okay, let's bump that up to 79 or 80. Um, yeah, so this one is bumping up. Balance. Yeah, I, I need to get more balance. I think I'm I'm screwing up with balance. Strength. Could always use more strength. Aggressiveness. Not so much. 
it's just to balance some things, you know. But definitely, I want to get uh, wrist shot power up for sure. <clears throat> Puck skills is not actually going up on its own, so I don't need to worry about that so much. But like some of these other things, like skating, obviously, I need to get physicality can be improved. So yeah, definitely strength. I'm thinking. Sixteen this week. Alright, so Okay, and I have four hours remaining. <coughs> Durability. There we go. I was kidding. Let's uh bounce that out, huh? There we go. Slap shot accuracy. Or shot accuracy. And we get more into bounce, more into agility. <clears throat> it's not bad. This is gonna keep going on, by the way. I have to keep doing this um, until the draft. <laughs> uh, so let's see here. Um, I don't need offensive awareness. I'm pretty good with that. I, I definitely don't need this. <clears throat> let's get one to power skating. Um, let's get one or two wrist shot. Okay. Let's get one to strength training. More into agility. Fuck it. <clears throat> and balance. <clears throat> so, yeah, okay, so this is from the previous week. Acceleration, agility, balance, speed. <clears throat> Strength goes way up, which is really nice. I definitely need to bump that up. Fighting skills, aggressiveness. See, I don't know how you increase those. Just get to the 75 at least, then I can work my way up. <clears throat> Definitely wrist shot power though. I may wanna, I may wanna just slap all the wrist shot power up just to get that up like to 78. I'm thinking. <clears throat> For the next one, lock the skill point. Uh, sure. So I got one available. I got 78 overall. So let me see. Um. What's this one? Discipline, offense, awareness, poise. Oh boy, I don't think that's for me. <laughs> oh man, right, let's see. What's this one? Agility. That's not bad. What's my current agility right now? Oh, okay. No, actually, Oh wow. Endurance oh endurance is already big enough, okay. <clears throat> um let's see. Well, there's aggressiveness. <clears throat> uh, I mean this really, I mean, I could manually do it the other way, but, um, hand eye coordination, what's this calling at right now? Uh, hmm. Honestly, I can't tell you. <clears throat> I, I don't want to do any more shooting. Obviously, shooting is just not going to help me. 
And all these can be all done naturally. Like, I don't understand why we need that. I, I may, Maybe I should just go for something that doesn't get increased that, like, ferocity, maybe. I, I don't know, maybe this, like... That doesn't make sense. What do you mean how it goes? I don't care about fighting a lot much, really. The face-offs could be useful. But... Maybe I'll just hold on to this then, so I can get some of these then, I'm thinking. Skating will probably be more important for me anyway. Uh, I'm not going to spend it then, fuck it. Alright, so now... <laughs> I'm going to dump everything into wrist shot training, at least two into wrist shot training. Alright, so that leaves nine. Four, four, one maybe? <clears throat> oh, I can do this. And lateral move? Oh, no, I can't do lateral move here. Um, yeah, fuck it. Face offs, why not? <clears throat> there you go. I, like I said, I, just need, I need to get. I need definitely. The wrist shot accuracy is actually pretty fucking good, but. It's the shot power I need to get it to eighty. Everything else can just work itself out. Work itself out after that, but right now that's what that's what I'm aiming for. <clears throat> nice. Let's see, this is strength, stick handling. Don't need either of these. <laughs> if I'm being honest. Honestly, you know what? Just dump it onto this one. Fuck it. <laughs> Let's get like a massive boost on that. Oh yeah, this is gonna be good. The playoffs have ended. Stanley Cup champions, Natural Predators, Calder Cup champions, Colorado Eagles. Yep. <clears throat> 24. Alright, so. Actually, you know what I should do? I should just dump all this into power skating. Fuck it. I'm thinking maybe, hold on a minute. Four, four, wait. Four and four, that'll, that'll be uh, eight, no. That'll be 16 left. Now when I do this, that'll be 10. I'll do that. 
Oh, what a massive jump that is. Look at that. Beautiful. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Wonderful. Like I said, th we'll select workout June 9th to June 16th. This is going to be doing for the. I know this is not really the most entertaining video, but at least you can hear what my thoughts are anyway. I mean, that's kind of what I've been waiting for is to do all this. Alright, do a couple weight trainings. Do a wrist shot training. Oh. Um. About that, really. Let's do. What's his face off? Yeah, let's do two of these. Okay, that's five. Passing. I don't really need this. Power skating. Let's do normal to face off, why not? There we go, 79. That that's what I was looking for. Big numbers up for the acceleration and speed. And I guess for strength, well, strength is already over 20, uh, 75. That's actually not bad. <clears throat> I think I'll just dump the rest in. Uh, I don't know. Maybe balance. Maybe get that to. Maybe get balance up to 75. And then work my way towards um, uh, more wrist shot power, I guess. I think it was balance. I mean, I need to get balance. Um, so it was balance. Lateral movement. Oh yeah, this one. Very good, very good. Get the bounce up for sure. Obviously the other stuff doesn't really matter all that much. This is all good. This is all good preparation for me getting to the NHL. I'm just letting you guys know right now. It may seem boring, but it really isn't. Um, because I definitely need this. Okay. That's four. Five. And one more for four. Do that way. I oh, really miss coming to the rink every day and see my teammates. Damon from Cullen as he has said to retire. Good. Fuck you. <laughs> Trading block, Satinkirk. Trading block, Yal Martian. Stephanie Gianta decides to retire from the game. Sad day. Well, good. I'm glad. Unless we have to worry about this clown shoes. I don't know, just ignore me. I'm just being stupid right now. A skill tree. I'm still in 78. Uh, that's lame. Okay. That's fine. Let's go to the draft. Starting NHL entry draft. You've been drafted by. The Edmonton Oilers. Oh boy. Nah, well, I guess I expected 
to be traded or I was expected to be picked up by, or actually I expected to choose who I wanted to be traded to or picked up by, but eh, different. I, I, I've had Nashville Predators, I've had um, getting jumped, I've had Vancouver Canucks, I've also had Calgary, I think I also had a different team too. Okay, step one is done. You've been drafted. Nice go. Nice. Going first overall in the first round and being drafted by Edmonton Jones is quite the feathering your cap. The preseason is around the corner. You'll have to earn your slot on the pro roster regardless of going so early, so stay sharp. Okay. Simming to next season. Very well. Very nice. Uh, well, could be, could be worse, right? The Oilers are pretty good. They're a pretty good team. Not the team I want, but hey, you know what? It doesn't really matter at this point. Um, oh yeah, I need a balance, right? I said I was gonna get balance. Um, wait, what the fuck, man? Where's that little movement? Oh, there it goes. Actually, I'm just gonna dump all these into fucking. Uh, why not? Five times is good enough, I think. Uh, five and four, right? So let me get uh, power skating. Let's get one and through a shot, baby. <laughs> yeah. Get that fucking bounce up. Congru contract ready to go. Hey there, I have the I have the contract already for your signature. It's it's your standard three year NHL level level contract. Sign it in your official member and all this continue. Not bad, not bad. I'm close to eighty on the wrist shot power, which is what I want. Um <clears throat> eighty uh eighty one in agility, nice, close to seventy five pounds. It's actually pretty good. Maybe uh, I'm thinking one more into uh, ba um, balance to do it to trick. Or maybe two into balance and the rest can be put up to whatever. No, let's do that. <clears throat> let's do two. Let's do sprints. <clears throat> There we go. 75 in the bounds. Perfect. So that's pretty much where I should want it. 75. I, want it. I will keep increasing it as I go. Um, as far as that goes. Physicality. Like it's, like, like it's the physicality has to go up, go up obviously. Um, maybe I'll just keep putting it stuff into strength. I'm not, I'm not doing anything with this because I don't need to. I can just increase that as I'm playing the game. I need to straighten that, right? Alright. Get some slap shot training. At least balance that out a little bit. Balance gone up, agility's gone up, endurance gone up a little bit. Strength's gone up a lot, that's all I like to see. Nothing for slap shot, okay, I thought I'd put that on there. Huh. Riveting gameplay. <laughs> uh, I mean, I could have just auto-assigned it, but what's the, fu what's the fun of that? Come on. Uh, let me see if... Let's get some pure offensive stuff going on here. 
Yes, that's it. We're getting close to 80 on the wrist shot power, which is what I want. Now we go for uh, strength. Yeah, I think so. Oh. Oh man, I could, I could balance this out real quick. That's the lateral stuff. The well, balance is still going up on this. Not strength though. All right, so let's put two into this. Let's get... Weight training in. Let's get sprints in. <clears throat> oh, wait. Oh, I didn't think that through. Oh, well. <laughs> um, I'll put one into passing one up. Not like I need it, but fuck it. Just to balance it out. There we go. Ooh, so okay, so one more into wrist shot power to get it to 80, I'm thinking. Uh, speed, acceleration. Alright, everything is going up. Everything, everything's going up, Millhouse. Really good. I, maybe next time I just po post it in speed and acceler acceleration. Fuck it. Or acceleration and, yeah. Essentially, <clears throat> June twenty third. No, this, this has to be August. Okay, that's what I thought. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. All right, so one into a shot. Acceleration. This is good. It was lateral movement. Very nice. And the next four goes to passing. That's the stuff. That's the stuff of legends. 80, there we go. That's what I was looking for. <laughs> Alright. Passing goes up a little bit. Speed goes up. Acceleration goes up. Agility and balance goes up. I balance should be getting I should be getting more into balance, I'm thinking. So I may I'll just dump the rest of the agility and balance, I guess. I don't know. Strength goes up. Lateral moments up here, right? Fuck it, I'll just dump everything into this. Why not? A massive lateral movement in, in beast up. Woo, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Look at that juicy stuff. The next time is going to go. It's going to go skyrocketing. Oh, yeah. Continue simming. Yeah. Alright, so let's see. This is weight training now. Put no the weight training that gives me seventeen. Um lateral movements.
Oh yeah, look at that. <sighs> Boom. Impressive stuff right there. Look, look, at, look how much it went up. Man, that's awesome shit. If I do uh, endurance, not, well, endurance I don't need, need to go up anymore, but... Dicker could have level 7. Oh, oh. I would like to get the fucking 80 overall, but I don't think that's gonna happen. Six. There we go. Very nice. Small increases, that's fine. They all count for something. Oh my lord. They, they, you have to do this every off season. <laughs> crazy oh man this is fun stuff no but it's always like nice seeing a player evolve get to the next level get the highest overall you know what I mean it, to me I, I like it I think it's pretty cool some people think this is probably gonna be boring shit but hey you know what it is what it is you know Nice, nice skating. Very good. That's my. That's if I can get to level seven soon. Physicality needs to go way up too. If I, if I can get straight to eighty, that'd be pretty nice. All right, so just get more of that. Just get more of this. Um. Very nice. Close to level 7. That might be the next one, I'm thinking. You never know, though. Because I think the lowest run right now is skating. No, I'm sorry. Physical's the lowest one. But that's why I'm trying to beef that up with fucking strength. Strength should be going way up. Although, if I just do pure strength, I wonder how that's going to work. I should try to do it next time if it, let, if it lets me. Just do pure strength. Oh, finally. Wow. 79 overall. I'm not going to request trade right now. That's stupid. Let's see. Um, I said last time I wanted to do what? Oh, I got this at least. Speed is not bad. Right now, speed is... That could be pretty good. I mean, this one's also agility and speed. I do want me some of this. This is going to... I mean... I don't know. Should I even bother with that and just do this instead? Or... <laughs> I mean, this would actually help me out a lot. Because <laughs> uh, that, that... Oh, maybe not. Uh. That was really good though. What the 
the hell? Why is this? Oh my god. Holy shite. Uh, hold on a minute. How, how's this? Let's try to play this growth way. What needs to be tipped over the egg so I can actually get more? Maybe. Well, speed and acceleration will do it. Also, defense can go a little higher. Physicality needs to be needs gone up. Ah, oh, me. Fuck it, I'll, I'll do speed. Fuck it. Although, now I'm thinking about it, you always get. Uh, you know what? Maybe I shouldn't. Because remember, if I I have two right now, when I hit 80, I have three. That means I'm going to have a maximum of 19 more after that. So, <laughs> it, it's not looking very good. So, uh, we'll just leave it at this for now. I have high hopes for you this year. Good to see your face again after these past months, a few months of downtime. <clears throat> Shortly we'll be heading into the preseason and you'll be meeting your teammates from the Edmonton Oilers and Bar Bakersfield Condors organization. The coach will fill you in on the plans for, for the roster. It's time to step up to the plate. Some people view the preseason as throwaway games, not me. I'll be watching closely out there to see if we have what it takes to play, with the Edmonton, play on the Edmonton Oilers roster. Impress me and you'll be called up. If not, the Bakersfield Condors will be home at the start of the season. Alright. So this is going to be... Uh, <laughs> Try pictures. Yeah. Look at that. Uh, we get one more game under our belt, and that's about it. 90, 85, 75, 86, 90, and 75. Right. Okay. I understand this, this hour video is not going to be that entertaining for some of y'all, but remember, I just wanted to show you the process of which I, I played, I lost, and then all the improvements on my character, and then play one quick game, because right now it's like, one thirty on a fucking work night. So. Hi everybody with Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro. Ra I would, would rather just summer has passed. Hockey is here. The sticks are unwrapped. All the gear not play too long. And it's the preseason. But before we get started here, the thoughts of Eddie Olchek. The wins and losses don't mean much as we kick off the preseason. So Stuart Skinner. Keep an eye on the micro stories, the new faces. That Tyler to Parsons. That they deserve a roster. Goalies are ready, the centers are ready, the officials are ready, largely Shit are it. ready. 70, 55, 63, oh my god. Speed, speed, oh, well, that's not going to be good. One, that's what preseason hockey is about, and we have begun. Why were you pinning the simulation? Come on, man. Having a pass to Zingle. Puck is thrown to Puglio Yarvi. Laid on to Grefbaum. Good shooting place. Great stick there. A strong pass stop there. Collected in the corner. Um, sends it back the other way. I can't do anything. Sends it across the blue line. Fires it to the point. Pass the blue line. A shot. Oh, my, what a save. Collected in the corner. Back to the I think the game's not fucking point point doing what I want right now. The point. Point to point. Point to point. I can't even hide the fucking thing either. Well, nice to see glitches are part of the game still. I'm just gonna have to wait till a whistle or you know. Edmonton's gating in their own end, trying to get to the neutral zone. Let's it go. A big one timer. Oh he got it! You couldn't have chosen a better guy for that shot, or apparently a better guy to stop it. Carries it to the corner. Shot on goal. With no time whatsoever, he turned it aside. 
He had his eye on the puck the whole time. What a stop. Um, can I get in? It'd be better than this shit. It's one of those restraining fouls. It's a oh, good. penalty. And the arm of the referee is up. Calgary's roster goes down by one here. At least briefly, a minor penalty for hooking. Uh, more times than not, Doc, anytime you reach in around a player's hands that has the puck, Thank God. Oh you're going to get a minor. Edmonton's power play will have its first chance of the game. Well, the power play guys have to go to work now. This is an opportunity they hope for. You want one early, and you want to see if you can get on the board first. Looking to Murphy. Carries it on in from center. Calgary is transporting. Wait, why am I 96? I should be 98. Unless someone else is 98 on here. If that's the case, then that sucks. Then again, 96 is uh, Sergei Federov's number, right? What was that, 97? Using the point, he's got it. They must retreat and start back again. And he gains the zone. Takes that pass up the boards. Let's it go. Save. Cleared it back out of there. Huh. Good work along the boards. Strong play. Good reach. Gives it to the point. Good intercept in his own end. Loose puck. The defense got in the way there. Just like we expected. Wow. The first big one. Oh my hey, god. I need more strength, man. That is a balance. Holy shit. So satisfying to have delivered a hit like that. Dude, I'm going to be fucking injured if I keep getting hits like this. Oh my goodness. Finally, it fucking does something. <laughs> oh my god. That was terrible. Just under 6 minutes played here in the first. We are deadlocked at 0. And he dumps it in. Receives that pass right near the net behind. Steps across that line. A point blast! That puck was obstructed by a screen. Oh, what a hit that one was! Murphy's on a mission out there, clearly trying to set the tone physically for his Wow, about time to call me Murphy. Passed across the announcers point. didn't do that. Sends it across the blue line, and he gets it back. Sends it back the other way to Gagne. Great block. Gets it back. Not able to do that well. Pitching this one to Lucic. Directing that one to Gagne. Is able to move on in. Good place to shoot from, and he does. Pitching it to Bailey. Man, it's even harder to get positions here to score. Because I was in the OHL, and now I'm in the NHL. Well, not yet. Officially, yeah, but <clears throat> Calgary's got it in mid ice. Shoots that puck struck him in front. He corrals it again. Slid the car. Solid glove save. The tie-up. He needed help, and he got it. Passing one off now to Gagne. Snaps one. Outstanding save. And decides to just cover it up and get the whistle. Parsons is going to stop that puck all night long. It's not a difficult shot, but it's his positioning that makes it look so easy. The Oilers win it. Drives it. Great save. When you're screened like that, you just have to hope it hits you. Hmm. Hey, wait a minute. Who the hell? I need to figure out why my number is 96. I mean, it doesn't matter really, but. Calgary's got a face off win. I usually pick the same number for all my. It does, 98 is just a number below 99. That, that's why I always and pick it. He gains the zone. Got it at the point. Let's it rip. Save. Loose puck. It went off one of the guys there. 
Edmonton's carrying on up the wing. Oh, the pass just didn't work. Crosses that line. On to Lindholm. Marvelous save. A great chance was no chance. Big drive. And off target with that one. That's what you call there. Grip it and rip it. He just missed it. Fantastic poke check. Looks ahead to start something. It is more faster pace, though. The Oilers skated up on the side. Terrific determination by Gagne. Terrific shot block in the lane. Close in play. Oh, come on. Scooped up by Backlund. Pass attempt to Jordy Ben. I gotta be careful. That, that could have been an interference call. I don't want to get a penalty here. I want to try my best not to take penalties in the NHL. That way, <laughs> my discipline goes up because I that is abysmal right there. I, I, like I said, Edmonton Norris is not a bad team to play for, honestly. I could have could have had a worse team, like Hurricanes or something. Skates it into the zone. Score! A power play goal. <laughs> I'm just messing with you. Our Hurricanes is a good team. <laughs> like the Penguins. Oh, and that, that's to say, Sidney Crosby of Getty Malkin is not a fucking good team team duo with Chris Letang and. But I don't know. I'm, uh, like, you know, damn well, they're not really looking for someone like me. They'll certainly have more energy. They've got the game's first score, and now they can play from in front. Oh man! The Ooh. Oilers have gotten the first goal of the game. Perhaps they can carry that off the ice with them. The clock has bled down Ooh, to the last minute. two nothing. Great, now I'm on the PK. Oh, Calgary's God. in possession as they travel in the defensive zone. Oh boy. That was dangerous. I don't know why I did it. I, I subconsciously always do that. Hold on one for this. Oh, I, oh, I see. They spent most of this first part of the power play going up and down the ice. He just fanned on A one A shot, save, and he holds on and stops play. I've been invisible in this game, which is okay, I guess. First period has been completed, and so intermission activities are forthcoming, but the players get a breather. The Oilers have a 2-0 advantage. Eddie, we're about to enter the second period here. What did you think of the opening period of our game? The Flames didn't play with the puck much in that first period. It's reflected on the scoreboard. They'll need to gain more possession time in order to generate more chances and turn things around. They'll have to be pretty quick at the start of this period to get anything going because power play time is short. Edmonton's back to full strength. They've killed off the penalty. And now it's directed to Bailey. Or already to the bench? Why? Let me go. Oh, bad luck. Trying to go to single. Terrible fucking line change. Two one. I thought so. The flames skated up on the side. What the very least? Nice work by Gagne. Steps in from the neutral zone. Got a piece of that one. Solid work there by Neil. Oh. Propelled to Froleek. Froleek? Bobby Froleek? No, I'm thinking Froleek. No, there's another player called Froleek. I don't remember what team he was on. No, no, not the whole league. Fro Froleek was a different player, but. You're not going to beat a goaltender of this caliber with that shot. That's a pretty easy blocker stop. Okay, Ray Ferraro. Had I missed the net, you would tell me I need to shoot it at the middle of the freaking net to get it any sort of scoring chance. See, 
This is the type of thing I, I don't like about the commentary of this game. If you if I'm shooting a puck, right, and I just completely miss it by like three or five feet, they say, well, you have to, you may as well just shoot it in the middle of the net, at least at least hope at least hoping to get a chance for a rebound. So when you do that, he says shit like this. So you, it's just to harass the people playing the game, which is why most people, when they play these games, they turn off the commentary or off. It's just bad scripting. I don't know why they decided to do that, but I just do it because it makes the sound authentic, even though the fucking commentary is just, like, recycled for, like, for the six years. And directed up the wing to Neal. Onside. Chip to Larson. In the corner by James wow, talk about quick fucking up to the point. Shoots it on. Stick to some. Snapping a pass to Lucic. And the what whistle the? signals an offside. Oh my god, this game, man. I wasn't caught offside if you actually allowed me to get off the fucking uh ice. But you decided to oh no. Let the switch positions on me, cause hey, I wanna fucking know, I'm an idiot. Calgary is in their own end, hoping to make a play to center. Puck is thrown to Froelich. Shoots one. Good save there. Really solid job done defensively. That takes some of the pressure off when you can use your stick like that. And he dumps it in. Those are not the time to the poke check the puck. I would have to be literally in front of him. Wasn't intentional. Didn't go well. Loose puck. Looking to Lucic. Pitching this one to Gagne. Oh. Mm. He's got that one. Let's see what happens. Well, at least they're not telling me that. What a ripper! At least he protected his goaltender. Directed on. Pad block. Nice save. Tough to follow. In front. What a hit that was. Oh, he's been looking for that hit all night. Shoots. That shot came from yeah, go to the bench. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. That move not too slick there. Well, nah, I missed everything on that. This sucks. Directing oh, well. that one to Gotta be patient. They just played decently enough with him. It's, hey, how are you playing the third line? Okay, sure, no problem. I mean, I'll play in the third line. He picks up a perfect pass. Boy, what vision out of the defensive zone. See, yeah, see, the NHL just plays point. differently than the OHL. Look. Laid on to Ben. Let's a shot go. Pitching it to McDavid. Driving in from no man's land. Fires. Score. I got an assist. Another power play goal. I got an assist. That's pretty good. Uh, that's at least you're putting something on the score sheet, right? You're contributing somehow. As much as I would love to score goals, I need to get in the Drasidal height. Drastal. When in doubt, go to the backhand. Oh, that's a great finish, but this play starts back with the puck carrier. He makes an excellent pass, opens up enough room for him to shoot the puck. Hey, I'm the one who got the puck originally. Edmonton's got an enormous lead, and it's in the second period. We're Hopefully gonna keep putting the score sheet up to ten to now. one, baby. Calgary's coaches have been on their players to pick up their commitment, to pick up their effort. Fuck Calgary. They got no gas left in the tank. Yeah, we, we fucking, we, uh, we put water he on that gas. That uh, I mean, nice tip of the pass. We, bur he throws it there. we burnt them out with fire a long time ago. Passing one off now to Lucic. Milan Lucic? Oh, man, that, that guy's good. Nicely received at the point. On to Murphy. Waffle boarded. And yet another save. How does he do that? That second save was textbook. To Murphy. Back to the blue line. Puck collected. Oh, an error on that pass. Oh, I did not mean to do oh, that. I'm going. I did not mean to do that at all, but hey, it's better than nothing. 
Team, how is team play still low? I should be pretty high on team play. I think this game is full of shit. This game's bullshit. Is what it is. It's dumped in. The power play unit has to recoil and try yet again. Takes that pass. Hammers one. Save. And he holds on, and the whistle stops playing. No. Just a hair over four minutes remaining in the period. You can see momentum in this game. It has shifted, and it is expanding even more. The advantage is four goals. Say! Oh. Maybe I was trying to go the other way, and it somehow went that way. Whistle. I don't know. That's probably not... I know some people say that's not really a really well-placed shot, even though that's what it was, but... From the face off, and they lock up, and a good reach. That's help from the wing. Can start the attack going in the zone. Keeps it going back behind the net. Goes to the backhand. May not have been intentional, but he got it anyway. Oh, snaps a shot. Score! Oh, my God. Connor McDavid. <laughs> He fucking destroyed that shit. 6-1. We are completely destroying, dismantling, eviscerating, exploding this team. Okay, I just said all sorts of random words. <laughs> That's kind of what it feels like, though. I got it. It's just a one. So this it's not how hard you shoot it, but it's the Remember, that, that play only starts because I interfere with the fucking pass. Like he was the zone. There, Edzo, as he drops into the butterfly position, not enough of the net cover. Goalie to the bench, substitution made. Well, it was pretty clear a little while ago in this game that this was not going to turn out well. He has not had a very good night. The coach looks like he's clearly fed up with it. And while the team has played very poorly, the number one way to change the game is to take your goalie out. Yeah, because it wasn't like most of those goals were his fault. It's always the players in front of him. Pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. Save there. Edmonton's moving the puck in their own end. And he dumps it in. Collected by Jordy Ben. Moving it to Zarin. Jordy Ben, huh? Let's say in with it now. And offside is called. Wow, 50%, man. That's actually pretty good on the face off. One. Possession established here. Good place to shoot from. That's not what. Wonderful stop. That's weird. That's not what I did. I meant to slap it like a like a hard slapper to get a rebound. He just wrist shot at it for some reason. A shot. Point blank save. Looked like the net was open for a second. It, it's almost like as if the. Let it go. Stick handling failed a little bit there. Puck loose. Oh, good it's fuck. In. Terrific determination by Hamonic. Fuck you. It's not a long shift. It was an extra, what, 10 seconds? Give me a break. 10 seconds, a long shift. Get out of my fucking face with that shit. It's garbage. Get back, Get back into the fucking locker, you little bitch. Here and still more to go. A well-deserved rest is at hand. Let's take a look at the two period shots on goal totals. They are whopping. 29 for the Oilers. And 22 for Calgary. The passing is perfect, nearly. Gracious. No power plays, right? Oh, no, no. Four minutes, 48 seconds, and this two minutes. Okay. So that, that, that's like two penalties and a half. Huh? Third period about to begin. The rear view mirror will help us with the first two, and so will Edzo. Calgary's got a real tough task ahead of him as we get ready for the third period. They know they're facing a hot goaltender. They know they've created a lot of chances. They need a bounce. They need to get a greasy goal. In order to do that, you've got to put yourself right in front of the goaltender. Backhander to the net. Got his glove on that one. Gains the zone. Shoots. Outstanding save. What magic even to get there and get the shot off. Great opportunity. Better stop. Face 
Bounce off the tie-up and a solid job from the winger there. To the point it comes. Good oh, solid boy. defensive there play with the stick. And he dumps it in. And the pickup. Oh my god. Calgary is skating from the neutral zone. Gathered up again by Lucic. Off that right side, he's got a perfect pass. Oh, quick shot. shift, yeah. It's a fun game, even though I'm not really doing all that much. Against, yeah, I thought that we can score. Now it's directed to Clefbaum. They score! Oh my lord. Is that a rat? What the fuck? What mascot is that? You know what I wish this game allowed you to do? Like, you did, like, if you moved your stick or any buttons during, like, any, during this, like, animation scene, like, you play with those. I, like, damn it, man. Oh, uh, this has been quite a night for him. He's had his fingerprints all over this game. He's been on the body, he's shown some skill, he's gotten to the front of the net. I'm really impressed with what I've seen from him tonight. Just over five minutes have passed. Relax, Ray. Third. Calm down. So one. I mean, I, I, I know you, you have a mouthful, but shit. Gotta take it easy, buddy. Such a good stick. That could have been held by a Canadian of the 70s. He's got that point pass. Reads the play and keeps it. Great save. Oh. To Zarnik, trying to go to Carr. That point pass as well. He lost possession there. Edmonton's in control as they travel up the wing. McDavid's been outstanding this evening. He's just jumped back on the ice. His coach doesn't want him resting too long. He's been so good all game. Yes, he has been. Sadly, I have not been. Well, I got that one goal. I mean, that one pass. This is pass whatever. Through center ice. That puck is loose on good defensive play. Shoots. Big point blank save there. Great display of goaltending right there, Doc. To McDavid. McDavid's looking to add some more points to a huge evening. That puck exits the zone, so play has to reset. Snapping a pass to McDavid. Gains the zone and looks over his options. Chip to dry cycle. Using the point. Rebounds it forward to McDavid. Laid on to Murphy. With a shot! Locked it away! Didn't handle it very well. Free puck. Had it away! Slid to Murphy. And that puck goes offside. I knew that was going to happen. I was trying to get away from the other defender. Darn, man. Eh, well, it is what it is. It's game to comment on because it's been nothing but goals, goals, goals. There's not been many saves to talk about. The goaltenders have had a difficult night defensively. They haven't had much help either as both teams are filling Yeah, you see, he's 98. You see? That, that's actually the first time it actually happened. I, I don't think I've ever seen a play with that number, even if, it, even if it's an AI uh, character. Is thrown to Lucci. I don't mind actually. I think it's pretty cool. Right to the point. With a blast. Puck ricocheted off the screen. Looking to Lucci. Pitching this one to Murphy. Oh, and they've got a two on one here. Missed the puck on the shot. Attack. Oh my god. That was, got it in their own end, that was so good. Seven. Directing that one to Froley. Sucks. Almost, man. I was almost a goal. I like that. It could have been, should have been, but it wasn't. The Oilers win the draw. 
involved. Shoots. Blockered away. Good work with the stick. Banked right ahead. I like that play. He had a little bit more of a risky option, but he went off the boards and bounced it safely to his partner. Pitching it to dry cycle. Wow, these guys are riskying with the fucking windmill deeks. I do that all the time in the OHL. That's only because it's a lot slower. The Oilers have a manpower advantage still and begin from their own end. McDavid's hooked on the play. There will be a penalty. The Oilers get their goalie to the bench for the extra man. Swept on to Clefbaum. What the f And now we'll get the penalty call. The Flames are given a hooking minor. Every game presents a fork in the road. 97, 98, 99, 96. Oh my five god. Three power play. And it begins now. This 5 on 3 power play has to be careful that they don't get lulled into a sense of security here. Oh! Man! That was so good! These are the times when everybody gets a chuckle at somebody else's slight misfortune. Picked up by the defense. Turn the goal now. The physical play has allowed the Oilers to really have a good strong shift. Shot blocked. That was a that was one of my better shifts in this game. You saw how I quit right off and I shot it and hit the post. Oh. <coughs> Man. Oh. Let's not get no cramps, shall we? God, that's like the bane of my existence. I hate cramps. Did the worst. I had a I had a muscle cramp in my finger, if you could believe that. That was hellish, bro. Hatchets one, a great opportunity, but he missed the net. How did he shoot the puck that quick? Passing one off now to Jordy Ben. Takes it in from the neutral zone. On the outside, a shot. Calgary's in their own end, setting things up. And he dumps it in. Fluff buffins. Pass attempt to Murphy. Oh. And open ice. This was part of their game plan. Be physical. Missed the net. Came close with that shot, but just off the target. Yeah, that was a, you see what I was trying to do there? I tried to go for the windmill dig like they did, but he <laughs> just creamed me instead. That's what you got to be careful of, unfortunately. It's a risky move, depending on it, but you could also break away from the Moving defender, too. The Simon Gagne? Oh my god. It's dumped in. Or, or maybe it's a different Gagne. It maybe, maybe it's his son. Like, He's in on Andre Gagne. Play. No, I'm just fucking... Let's it go. That's what those pads are for. That is up close and personal. Lindholm's often the object of a target. He's so good, nobody wants to give him much room, but he gets tagged there. Yeah. Loose puck I don't give a fuck. Through. Big drive! Robbery there! That went off someone, loose puck. Oh, this no! Amazing oh, Man! <laughs> no, how do I not get there, man? That was so good. Half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. Damn, man. That was right on there, man. That was right up front. <laughs> well, that was a pretty good game, though. Uh, even, even though I got one assist, I got a pretty good scoring chances. Something to be proud of. I didn't take a penalty. I think. He just got his first win at this level. It's just a preseason, but he looked great, Doc. Or did I take a penalty? I don't, know. Care of this I, I don't think so. More to follow for Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro. I'm Mike. The puck Good helmet. Night, everybody. No, I was just caught off sides. So that doesn't really matter. I'll take those any day of the week, my friends. Let's yeah, see. Discipline. Offensive awareness is up to almost 99. Not bad, not bad at all. Decent, decent stuff right there.
a preseason game. Alright. Players growth, let's see how that works. Okay, so how much do I need now? So the next one has to be gone up for me to get to the next level, looks like. Looks like endurance might be the best bet. <sighs> okay. Let me see some. Hold on a minute. Uh, I don't really care about his stats. I just want to get to mine. I want to. I want to check my. I want to see what it says about the play info. Elite mid, uh, mid. I don't know what that means. Roll third, third score line forward. Okay, it's not bad, I guess. Drafted first round playmaker. It says playmaker. Although I I did set up a goal so. Two way signed three way of eligibility no eight hundred and fifty million just look at that type of number man if I could just get like a an eighth of that I'd be fucking off I man you have no idea man it sucks but it is what it is uh, actually gonna, I'm gonna edit my player before I stop playing I wanna. Change his beard, probably get a clean, sh clean shave going. You know, I think I only had that for the playoffs. Oh my God! I should have had that. So that's clean shaven. Alright. Uh, for now, then I'll maybe I'll move that up to that. You know. Whoa. Whoa, what was my current one? Hairstyle that one. Slick back, yeah. Yeah, I still like this one though. I'm not going to change that. Do I make a quick... You know what? Fuck it. I'm going to have one more game. One more game. It's risky, but I'm going to do it. Minus one, one game play, one assist, shot attempt, what? shooting percentage. I had 10 shots and I went in, obviously. Power play points. Uh, 15 minutes on ice. Uh, three blocks, two hits, giveaways, takeaways. Uh, it's pretty even. I'm feeling rather intrigued to see how this one goes. I hope you guys are enjoying this special. Um, this is not a planned thing. I just did at the. I just did it for no reason. Other than the fact I wanted to do it. 
the players get in position for the opening faceoff, what do you think the fans should know about this one? I was there, Doc. It was sad to see the old Jets take a one-way flight to the desert, but the Coyotes have emerged as a fun, unique franchise ever since. Now we have the pleasure of watching young talent climb the ranks in the roster. Yeah, so I the we'll Phoenix Coyotes year, we call the Winnipeg Jets. Which sucks, but, you know, it is what it is. Arizona's got oh, here we go. Not this shit. Oh, play. thank God. Thank God. <laughs> I didn't do the same bullshit last time. The Coyotes organizing back in their own end. It's dumped in. Puck is thrown to Gagne. Steals that pass at center. Oh. Glass, and we get a stoppage of play because of that. Another gun, yeah. Play halted down to the ice and Ray. There are so much more travel challenges playing in the Western Conference. These games are so important. Every once in a while, you catch a team that's traveled a long way on the night of a back-to-back, -back, and you can really take advantage. Many thanks, Ray. Arizona's in their own end, moving the puck. Snapping a pass to Demers. Took that pass right up the wing. Feeds the point. Puck loose off the enemy this time. Murphy's got this one between the blue lines. Receives that pass from the other side. Took that away in his own zone. Let's it go. Well. No, no, not much I can do. I gave the puck to him, and he just turned it over. It is what it is. <clears throat> Looking to Lucic. Passing one off now to Bouchard. Is able to move on in. What a ripper! Very important steal for him. Oh. Holds on and gets that whistle. Usually when you see shoving and pushing after a whistle, it leads up to something bigger. And I mean a lot bigger. Yes. Just wait until they get to the locker rooms. They're gonna be really really be talking to each other. <laughs> Edmonton's got it again. They're gonna be measuring which one has the bigger from the other point. Oh no. Arizona's controlling play now off the wing. Can he beat him here? Stands his ground on the breakaway. Just under six minutes have been skated so far. Nothing up on the score sheet yet. The Oilers with a clean win on the draw. Directing that one to Lucic. Up the wing with it now. And he dumps it in. The hell was that done? Wow, for? that's gotta be a call. Oh my the god. Is coming. Goalie to the bench, extra attacker out. He takes that point pass. Didn't miss by so let me guess, charging. The Oilers lose a man mm. for two minutes for charging. <laughs> I knew it. That whole thing earlier. It was a great hit, Too though. Many strides taken, Doc, while making contact. That was Luke Cheeks. <laughs> he always tells me about Luke Cheeks. There's only one person called Luke Cheeks in the fucking in the game. The Coyotes will send out their power play unit for the first time. Uh, the numbers show if you get the first goal, you have a way better chance to win than if you're chasing the game. A power play, what a great chance here to get on the board. First. Yeah, but that didn't help us, obviously. We still lost tonight, tonight's game. I meant the real hockey game, and not the Oilers. Talking about the Rangers. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. Oh, yeah, this guy. All you need to do is put that in someone's bedroom. That lotto meter will go right up. Solid face off win. On to Grapner. Wow, what a glove save. And he holds on, and the whistle stops play. Good offensive zone win. Gives it over to the point. He wore that puck on a hard shot. He throws it there. Oh, and he 
misses. That's what you call there. Grip it and rip it. He just missed it. Way outside. That move not too slick there. That well, thank you. Flip to the opposite corner. A successful clear. Oh, look at this. He's alone. Can they catch him? Button quickly back. Just a backhand. The lane was jammed and it hit somebody. Man, see that was a successful windmill dig, but I didn't get any time to shoot. I didn't get a chance to shoot the puck. That always happens when I do a successful dig like that. Not good. Laid on to Barrett. The Coyotes skated up on the side. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. In the slot. Stepping behind. Back on his stick. Skates it behind the net. Dishes it back. Sends it back the other way. And he gets it back. Puck free. Roadblock by Lucic. They've got all the gunners out. Sends it down low. This is a freaking power play? Good lord. Freezes play. Carries it on in from center. Took it up the boards and holds. Has it in his own end. Edmonton skating in their own end, trying to get to the neutral zone. Shoots one. That's a good save and goal. They're going to have to come up with something better than that. Flings it. That puck struck him in front. Pat it away. Pat save. Great offensive job here. Means nothing if they don't score them. On the half boards to Gagne. Picked up by the defense. Can start the attack going in the zone. Well, this is going to be maybe a scoreless game. <laughs> well, I just started, though. Ah! I don't. Oh, no, I don't. All right. Very well. The Coyotes in their own end ready an attack. All the pressure still on as they can't clear. Damn it, I, I didn't hit the button in time. Arizona's carrying it up the wing. Takes that pass. Defensive Jim with the stick. Chip to Murphy. Oh. And the face off will come all the Damn. way Damn. Because. I, I thought the other guy was going to come around, so I, that's why I passed it that way. Didn't work, unfortunately. Over three minutes to go in period one. It's a one nothing game. Edmonton's got a face-off win. The Oilers have it along the side at mid-ice. It's dumped in. Play is offside. Back to center ice. The Oilers got that face-off win, now what? Skill play by Larson. Slid to Murphy. Brought on and the forwards can change on this dump in. Propel to Demers. Pitching it to Grabner. it into the zone a stick comes up and a penalty will be called are you kidding the me the Oilers are boxed for two minutes on a high sticking penalty the Coyotes power play gets another chance to operate well wow, that's new I never heard that before they've been on the power play before it's not been very effective but they get another one handed to them here shot oh my that one was Way wide. He's 
find yourself in a slot with the puck on your stick, you better at least make the goalie make the save. Unfortunately, he shot that one well up. Couldn't get through. It's loose. On to Murphy. Shot on. Kind oh, my on God. That. that puck is held, and the whistle stops play. I can't believe that it got blocked. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie said no chance. That's an excellent save. <laughs> 20 minutes have passed. They worked hard in that period. Edmonton's connected once, and that's the only goal. Willemans Recycling is a proud sponsor of tonight's game. Willemans Recycling recycles them. Hungrier than ever. Yeah, I'm sure you are. The Coyotes special teams are pretty good. Let's see how their power play does here as it continues into this period. Again, this is the fourth time that's happened. I, I shoot the puck and it whiffs on it. It's, it's so weird. It's like everything is just so different in the regular NHL. The Oilers shoot it back out. Got some time to check the clock and prepare to defend again. Gives it to the point. Missed the net. Oh, man, I haven't seen a shot miss the net by that one. That's got to be 10 feet wide. What a joke. <laughs> Ten feet wider. Back to the point. The pass fails, and the puck goes skittering out to center. Good place to shoot from, and he does. Has it back deep. Uh. Laid on to Cousins. And so that one is cleared, and they check the clock and get ready for more. Wow, two nothing. It's pretty good. Right play, right pass up the right wing, and it's on his stick. Steps in from the neutral zone. Moves it to the corner. Kicked out of that battle. And the pickup. Lock loose. Strong defensive play by Demers. Puck covered. Whistle blown. Oh, this hasn't been really a great game for me. But that's the. Sometimes it's like that. You just don't have great games all the game, other days you do. Pop dropped in the log jam and the winger reached in and got. Him. Can he generate something? Terrific determination by Gagne. Wonderful stop. He's locked in now. Great save. They just keep working away, don't they? Heads behind the net. The physical play has allowed the Oilers to really have a good, strong shift. Collected at the boards. Throws it. That's a great save. I was oh. to go up. No celebration this time. Close. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. Uh-huh. Thank you. A little over seven minutes have passed. The Oilers <coughs> will lead 2-0. Chip to Hinestroza. Right to the point. Right into the slot. Loose puck and went off one of the guys there. Edmonton's on the move, hoping to wheel it up the wing. Oh, Pocek saved one there. May not have been intentional, uh. but he got it anyway. Gathered up again by Gagne. There's a hooking call on this play, but he keeps going. Whistle is blown. Penalty call. Guilty party departs. The Coyotes are given a hooking minor. Edmonton's power play will have its first chance of the game. Just because it's your power play doesn't mean you can take a nap here. You have to work hard and continue to generate chances. 
Oh, thank you, Ray. Like, like we don't know this. Solid, clean win. Taken right up the middle. And he dumps it in. The Oilers are at the wing in neutral ice. Nice tip of the pass. Wow, now it's man, that's a lot of Hayden. broken plays. Nothing's actually going Point through it. like it did in the in OHL. Pitching this one to Murphy. Oh, he's got this one, but can they catch up to him? I was going to give it to the pass. Takes that pass up the boards. Slid to Larson. And thrown down to dry side. Shoots. Saved with the pad. Right on his stick. Can he get it out? He finally got it out of there. Moving it to Murphy. Fires. Saved there. And decides to just hold on and get uh, a stoppage of play. Not really getting good shots. That, again, that is a shot with no rebound. That's not really what I should be aiming for, but... To dry cycle. Gains that offensive line. Stole that pass away in his own end. Puck cleared out. Power play unit goes back. Oops. The Coyotes are back even. Edmonton's in possession as they move up the wing. Propelled to Murphy. I got back checked almost immediately when I got the puck. Progress ahead. A long scorcher. Save. Loose, couldn't drag it through. Chipped off the boards and ahead. A slot wrister. Oh, a near miss too high. He's not going to get a better quality chance than that in front. Two sticks together, they cancel. Lots of pressure right now. They've got to break that. Trying to go to Henestroza. Reads the play and keeps it. Wow. Unbelievable. A free puck now. That's a pass ahead. That one is pointed to him. Good, solid defense there. Stole that pass. Worked into the corner by Grabner. Wow, that's the longest shift I've had in this preseason. Crazy. <clears throat> Ahead on that left wing to Lucic. Slide. Smart recovery by Demers. Arizona's carrying on up the wing. Terrific defensive work. Pass attempt to Gagne. Takes a shot. Good shot, but a better save. God darn it, man. I feel like slap shots, like, and you have so to, you know, it is, is it, it's inconsistent. Result. Like, you have to just get the wrist just shot, like, bam, like that. The only, like, fucking flies to fucking by one team. dead body or whatever. Arizona's in the neutral zone along the way. It's dumped in. Puck is thrown to Gagne. Snapping a pass to Murphy. What a ripper from the point. Oh, I tried. <laughs> I tried getting one shot on that, and I just missed it completely. Back in his defensive end to get it. Looking to Gagne. Passing one off now to Lucic. Using the point. Moving behind and considering. Gathered up again by Grabner. That worked, but not 
to the extent that I would like. On the outside. Great save. Edmonton's in their own end, continuing on. And he dumps it in. Laid up that right side to Fisher. And moved down to Grabner. On to Demers. Throws it into empty so it can be retrieved. It's dumped in. Got it in his own end. <laughs> Two one. Ah, huh? I thought I thought it was much. Hmm. Okay. Pretty interesting. I played uh, not that great, poorly, I would say, but. As we look at the shots on goal, the player's arms are tired, and so is the guy with the finger on the shots on goal board. Look at this. 24, 40 minutes down, at least 20 minutes to go. What are your thoughts so now. far? Arizona's got a real tough task ahead of them as we get ready for the third period. They know they're facing a hot goaltender. They know they create a lot of chances. They need a bounce. They need to get a greasy goal. In order to do that, you've got to put yourself right in front of the goaltender. Laid on to dry cycle. May not have intended it, but it well, there's my durability that gets lost. The I need high durability, man. Important interception there. I'm just getting destroyed by some people with higher physicality than me. The strength. Directing that one to Henestrosa. Sends to the point. To dry cycle. He got rid of it. Some contact there, and the puck is loose. Pitching it to Zingle. The Oilers have the puck at center ice. Good clean win. Chip to Osterley. In that defensive zone, an important play. Another penalty? Oh my god. Fucking From hell, his own man. end on the power play, it's taken by Demers. And now it's directed to Fisher. He's got that pass at the point. You can almost count that one, but no, what a save. The penalty killers have struck again, getting him rid of it out of their own end. And at an angle to Larson. Slid to Murphy. To the point with it. Oh, great defensive play to intercept. Propelled to Hinestroza. Not bad. Good place to shoot from. <laughs> Pitching this one to Fisher. A chance to clear. Cleared back out again, and so the power play unit has to drop back. Picks it up in his own end. The Coyotes' power play unit continues to be a bunch of offers. Fires. Bunch of offers. Uh oh, I was on ice for that. <laughs> Shite, baby. Bit late on that. Edmonton's got possession in the defensive zone. Oh, that was a deflection, man. The Oilers' power play will reset, moving it to dry cycle. Gains the zone. He just flat out missed it. Scores! Nice. A power play goal. Connor McDavid scores again. I'm still like name six and seven eight nine nine. The 
Well, actually, 99 is actually, uh, no one can ever wear the number 99 ever in any team. The, the league completely retired that number for some fucking weird reason. I know, I know Gretzky, did. I guess it's out of respect to how great Gretzky was. Another assist, well, I, I made bank. I made bank with that playmaking ability right there. That's pretty good. Again, I like to I like to tell you guys this is not really the most. Lucic's decision was pretty easy. The most incredible commentary ball. because of the type of game I'm playing, but it's okay. It's That's something different, you know. Right on the tape. Edmonton's lead is now two. <clears throat> Here in the third period, they have to brace themselves for an attack. This is NHL 19, so this is an older game, but. And that's a face -off I like it. it sometimes I don't, but other times I do. A shot! Oh, terrific save on a great chance. That was a tougher stop than it looked. And on top of that, another great stop! Nice work by Gagne. Shoots! Gets it with the blocker! Really? countdown what 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 how come I just spawned on the ice the coyotes have it up the wing all right he's going to the bench roll the dice that went off the path oh they're pulling him out way early than normal got it in their own end hoping for center puck is thrown to Lucic snapping a pass to Murphy net empty no I didn't even do the directional on that he's got it there he wants to clear it out has it picked up it's an onside play. A backhand shot. A great opportunity, but he missed the net. Well, what a great opportunity in the prime scoring area on the backhand. That just missed. Net open. Missed. <laughs> I fucking miss. Oh, my God. Arizona's controlling play through the Get the frick out of my way, you dummy. Lucha oh, fuck it. I'm not going to sit Let's just watch how this plays out. The ends hey Zinger, Zingle, whatever your freaking name is, sit the fuck down, army. bitch. And that's the horn, that's the hockey game. The game missed is two ended. open and netters. I am pissed on that. Game. But the can be deceptive. The shots on goal were really lopsided. But I, I did get an like assist, which is pretty good. I'm on the stat sheet. You get a lot of pucks to the net and they don't go in, but you win the game. This Shut up. season game is in the books. Evaluations are being made constantly of the talent that ah, actually that was a pretty good game right there for me. For Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, I'm Mike Emmerich saying good night from here. Well then there's wrist shot accuracy. <laughs> oh, endurance went way up. I don't know if that's enough to push it to seven though. Probably a different um, category. Fiji Knights, nice. All right, well, that's pretty much it, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this special video of NHL. Um, I don't want to say goodness, but you know, I lo I love hockey, so obviously I wanted to do this just because I actually said on the last video um, that I was going to do this. Um, that was a long ass time ago. Um, And like I said, just to throw something out, something different. 
because I've been playing nothing but Elden Ring non-stop and I just want to throw out some different that's something that's a little bit new sorry about that I'm in the middle of doing <laughs> yeah but uh, anyway guys thank you much for watching hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys next time down the line on more NHL I want to try at least doing this at least every so often uh, show you guys the progress I made so you guys can check um, well I can't show you now but I pretty much I'm overall 79 doing pretty well I would say um, not the greatest but I mean for a rookie coming into the league I'm not doing I'm not doing that bad I got a couple assists I'm a playmaker I'm supposed to set up goals and plays whatever I think I'm doing a good job I haven't taken too many penalties at least on the, the two games I I showed you there with the Oilers um, maybe some down down the line. Maybe they'll trade me. Maybe I'll have a cross to trade. I don't know. I would like to get my way towards the New York Rangers and to stay there, but I don't want to do it immediately. It's just like it's not like the NBA 2K games. I don't, I don't want to fucking uh, request a trade too early. Like, come on, I just started fucking <laughs> with the Oilers. They at least give like a, a year or so uh, or two. But anyway. That's pretty much it, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys next time on either Elden Ring or some other game. I don't know. Maybe Dragon Ball Z or something. Peace. Out.